Hello, it's Alice the Dragon with some Stardew Valley and it's raining. Kind of appropriate because I have a bit of an agenda today. Not a Stardew Valley agenda, but I want to talk about mental health. Yes, uh, today is going to be interesting because... Uh, oh, it's not raining. Oh, it's just the wind. Uh, I like to give my cows a special special treat. Amaranth? No, no Marnie. I, I don't want to get Amaranth. Um, anyway, mental health. Today, um, I am going to have my first day of trauma therapy. So that's going to be interesting. Let's see, where are my other chickies? I keep forgetting to close the door at night. I don't know what to expect. I, I really don't, because... Oh, hi, Bella. Yeah, good girl, Bella. Anything in here yet? Oh, yeah, that's right. I haven't gotten that. I have to meet, be, like, friends with Demetrius, I think, to get that. But, you know, it's... Chicky, there you are. Oh, not the chicky I was looking for. That's everyone. I just, I, I don't know what to expect. I'm kind of, uh, just, like, it's an awkward feeling. <laughs> it's like, you know, you gotta do it, and you want it to happen, but at the same time, it's just like, it's probably gonna be painful on one level or another. that uh, is spinning around in my head and causing me problems. And I just... I don't have enough money to get a new pickaxe, so I won't do that. Uh, yeah, it's, it's so weird how, how things have kind of been set up. Because, like, I've been going to therapy for 15 years. Yeah, first I was diagnosed with depression and, you know, ADD, or ADHD, rather. And, like, and, and then bipolar 2. And now... It's like, you know, yeah, I finally found somebody who's willing to listen to me and they're, they're like, yeah, this, this sounds like trauma. And it's just like, yeah, is like, I feel like I'm on the right path, but I also feel kind of cheated by the system. And, uh, yeah, it's, it's kind of sad when you think about it, you know, it, it is, relatively speaking, a new field. Yeah, people don't know as much about how the mind works as you know, we probably should. And because for a long time, you know, people were saying, you know, if you're having mental problems, you know, it's pretty much your fault. Which, yeah, is we're finding out not the case. You know, it could either be brain chemistry, it could be, or, like, it could be, in my case, trauma, or maybe both. Hello, bat. I hear you. Wow. Why did I turn around and... Uh, it's because I had the mouse in the wrong place, isn't it? And whatever. Here's another bat. Come on, bat. I really want this to work out because I am just sick and tired of, like, let's say that, you know, this actually happened a couple of years ago, um, or maybe last year, I really don't remember, like, that, like, memory problems, we all know that that's a problem for me, yay, um, which apparently is also a symptom of trauma, so that's interesting, 
uh, yes, a couple of years ago, um, yeah, my, uh, my partner and I, oh no, oh no, this is happening, and I haven't found the exit yet, oh boy, okay, come on, yeah, it's like, my partner and I were at this, uh, haunted house with some friends, and, like, Haunted houses are fun, right? And it's fun to get scared, and I enjoy haunted houses. Ah, so many bats. Oh, did not mean to do that. Well, I guess that did something. And, uh, it was just like, oh, it revealed the exit. Yeah, get out of here. Uh,. And I was just like the whole time was just yeah thinking about basically how stupid I was and like it's not logical not in the slightest I need to uh, eat something and just basically what a piece of shit it I am. I'm, I'm swearing now without censoring because of the uh, COPA stuff. I just really don't want to get dinged with uh, acting like a um, kid's channel just because I play video games that may appeal. But, uh, yeah, that's, that's the way things are right now. Uh, where, where was I going with this? Oh yeah, like I I was I was just I was feeling like shit. Even even though I knew I shouldn't be feeling like shit because you know I was having fun with friends, but you know the fun just wasn't sticking. It, it wasn't getting through. You know whatever crap has accumulated, and I really 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 want that to stop. So, yeah, I'm doing trauma therapy today. That's going to be interesting because, because uh, I really don't know what to expect. I don't know how I should prepare for something like that. Like, is it a situation where you want to start with, you know, the big stuff, you know, some of the first stuff that happened? Do you want to go from the more recent stuff to, you know, to previous stuff? Do you start with the little things? I, I've been scouring the internet looking for answers to this question. And, you know, if you, if you feel like you have an answer, you know, I'll probably end up, uh... <laughs> I'm gonna die... Okay, gotta concentrate for a moment here because I am hurting and I should probably go home. Uh, I, I was talking with a coworker last night. Yeah, he he was uh, he's like the night guy. Oh my god, why did uh? Okay, I'm I'm gonna. Just get those and leave. That's that's all I can do right now. So yeah, uh, yeah. And we're talking. Yeah, and I you know bring up me mental health, and it's like yeah, I'm starting trauma therapy tomorrow. And he just doesn't get it. He, not in the slightest. He's just like you got to put the put the past behind you. You got to find faith in God. You got to you know you know st stuff like that. Can I have mushrooms? I, mean, I think mushrooms would be a very good idea for me. I hear that uh, mushroom therapy is highly effective for trauma stuff. Hi, how's it going, Robin? Just daydreaming? That's that's nice. Enjoy your carpenting, carpentry, carpet, bleh. Uh, carpentry par projects. Dang, I can't talk. 
<laughs> so, you know, I tried to be gentle about it. As, like, one metaphor I came up with uh, was, you know, imagine that for a year or two, you know, people just walk up behind you randomly and stab you with a fork. Just, no reason. They, they just walk up behind you and stab you with a fork. Maybe, you know, and, like, he didn't get that either, but, there we go, there's my fall foraging. Oh, I should have kept the plum and the hazelnut. Maybe I can go around and find some more. It's, it's 620. Uh, okay. Uh, and, you know... It could be that, you know, that's just his way of coping, and he kind of got stuck in that mindset that just because it works for him means it's got to work for everybody else, right? Right? No. No, the world doesn't work that way. You know, people, people are different, and that's a good thing, in my opinion. I would rather people be different because, you know, somebody else will see something that, um, that you might miss. Where did I put my... Right. Right, right, right. Hey! I remember I need to close my chicken coop. Let's close my chicken coop. There we go. I'm a responsible adult for the most part. Let's water some plants. Get that done. I don't know if these guys, like, they, they don't look like they're alive, but I'm going to water them anyway. You never know. Uh, it's... It, it yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, like, it, it, it all comes down to, I, I don't know what to feel, you know, about everything. And, uh, that's why I'm talking about it with you. Yeah, I, I do this for me, mostly because I want to figure out you know, how to help myself. Right, right. I should go see the wizard tomorrow. I still have that cola. Maybe I should stick this over here. I'm going to put this in here. I'm going to just put all of this in here. I don't... Unless I'm doing something specific, like, there's no reason for me to carry everything in there. How's it going? Let's the uh, weather report. Cloudy, windy, sounds good to me. It's 8.30, I'm going to bed early, I don't care. Uh, like, how do I prepare for trauma therapy? Like, that is the big question, and Bella wants to get under her blanket. But the blanket is in an awkward spot, and she's standing on top of it, so that makes it difficult. There you go, little girl. There you go. One of these days, I should just put up a video of her. Like, a video of her being cute, because, you know, I love her, and she's she's a great little dog. My partner was sick yesterday, and uh, and she did a very good job taking care of him. Uh, what's on living off the land? Uh, yeah, the Grange display thing. I think I'm gonna put a purple cucumber, among other things. Alright, uh, okay. Happy spirits. What am I doing? What's in here? Oh, right. All my seeds. I think I'm gonna put all my Grange display stuff in there. Uh... Talk to Gunther about stuff. My plants are growing. I prefer it when they are around that thingy. Hey, chicky chickies, how are you, my little darlings? Do we have any gold star eggs in here? Doesn't look like it. Gold star egg would be for us. That's it. 
to prepare for all this, I, uh, yeah, I've got pretty much my best comfy clothes on today. Yeah, I've, uh, put on my favorite scale print, uh, they're kind of leggings and they're kind of pants. Like, they're, they're not anything in particular. They, they, they don't hug your ankles like uh, most leggings do, so they kind of hang down like pants. So I like those. And I'm wearing... Oh, hi! It's, uh, it's uh, Shane. Hey, uh, hey, Shane. What do you want? Leave me alone. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, some, some people are like that. Everybody's different. I've got on the t-shirt I was wearing when I met my partner. Yes, my theory. Uh, oh wait, I gotta donate it to museum. There we go. Uh, thing. Donate to museum. I can collect some rewards, that's nice. Uh, let's put the frozen tear. Let's put that next to the petrified slime, actually. Said you had rewards for me? Pumpkin seeds. Sure. I, I don't really feel like uh, growing a bunch of pumpkins right now, but I do appreciate it. It's, uh. Yeah, I'm, wear I'm wearing the shirt that I wore when I met my partner, which is great. Um, and underneath that, I have a long sleeve shirt that has, like, it's, it's half, you, you know, you know that, uh, that fabric that's kind of waffle weave that, uh, long johns are made out of? I really want to find a hazelnut. Maybe there's some up here. Uh, and, uh, but the top half of the sleeves is lace. So it's a very interesting combination, and I quite like it. So I've got that, and I've got my wizard's coat, which is um, part of my um, my doodly robes. You know, like if I if I ever go out, and, yes, good thing I spotted that. If I ever go out and uh, say somebody wants me to preside over a funeral. Yeah, that that's what I wear. I wear I wear the wizard's coat. I wear uh, a t-shirt that has kind of a dude mandala on it, which is really cool. Um, and I wear uh, oh, these jeans that, um, that I got that have, like, colorful stuff sewn on the pockets. So, yeah, I, I like to say my favorite color is color. I walked right back by the community center. See, this is what happens when I want to talk about something specific. <laughs> I get distracted. Um... Uh, but that's okay. It's Stardew Valley. Like, Stardew Valley has no particular thing. The, it's up here. Like, there's just so many things that I've looked into recently that... Right, those are, those are the props. Forage is down here. Yeah, there, there's 
so many things that just in you know recent recent times you know in in all my research about mental health because I do a heck of a lot of research like I'm not in school or anything but you know when I want to know something I look it up and that's basically what research is do I have time to go down into the cave for just a little bit I'm, I'm gonna go down to the cave for just a little bit might as well because there really isn't much I want to do at the moment. Okay, these can go up here now. There we go. Got my cola. Hey, Demetrius. It's corn season? Yeah, I think I'm growing one corn. Oh yeah, it, it, is, it is peaceful. That's why I like to play this game. Alright. It's, like, I've been finding a lot of, uh, symptoms. Ooh, I like these guys. Come on, give me a, give me a solar essence. Yeah, maybe I should, uh, actually go, uh, go talk to the wizard and give him a thing, because I really want to, uh, Get into his good graces, because uh, then interesting stuff happens, right? I think. Maybe. Ah, uh, no, no, please no. Come on, die. No, 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 no. Done. I'm done. I'm out of here. I don't care. Uh, it's like they're, you know, looking into it, there are so many symptoms that I have that could be traced back to trauma. Yeah, uh, one, one thing I didn't expect um, is um, limbs can go numb. Yeah, and uh, my, my big toes essentially have gone numb. Yeah, for, first it was the right one, then it was the left one. Hey guys, how's it going? What am I going to make for dinner tonight? Uh, spaghetti and meatballs is always good. Or uh, if you don't like meatballs, mac and cheese is good. Maybe I'll just get takeout. Uh, well then, uh, you know, maybe, maybe we've got a teriyaki place nearby. You know, the, the teriyaki's good stuff. Oh hey. Are you friends with Clint? He's a nice guy if you get to know him. Oh, I, I bet he is. He gets lonely working in his shop all day. But he's so shy, he has trouble making new friends. Uh, I, I know the feel. I know the feel. <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, I've got, uh, at work, uh, there are these uh, two gals who uh, really like me for some reason. Like, they're in uh, the recreational therapy department. And I'm just going to go down this way. And, uh, you know, just one day they're like, you know, come hang out with us. And, you know, ha you know take your lunch in the recreational therapy office. And, yeah, I kind of just started doing that. I left my cucumbers. Oh well. How's it going? There are many mysteries around us. You must be patient if you wish to discover them. Discover them. Yeah. I will be patient. Like, patient is what I do best. Uh, yeah, the, these two gals in recreational therapy. I'm just like, uh... Yeah, I need to actually make friends. Yeah, especially lady friends, because I really don't have any lady friends except for Katie and Casey from college. And uh, if either of you are watching, hi! I miss you! 
Love you lots. Um, yay. Let's get some more going. Is it five or? Yeah, it's five. Put some stuff away. I really want to get the next upgrade for my pick because, I mean, there's a freaking meteorite on my on my farm. You know what else can you know what else is there to do about it? Uh, whoosh! Come on, guys, grow, 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 please. You're probably not going to, but I'm gonna water you. Uh, I don't even remember what any any of this is. That's okay. Maybe I should put a chest a little closer to all this. I think I will. Let's see, where's a... I'm just gonna make a new chest. I need wood. <clears throat> I'm looking forward to when I can uh, get the workbench. The workbench is nice. Alright. Uh, da -da -da. Chest. All right, new chest. Let's put it right, maybe here. I can put it maybe here. Hmm. Oh, I hear a bat. Ah. Ouch! Ouchie! Uh, good thing real bats don't do that. <laughs> Uh, if I put a chest right here, that could work, maybe. Although I kind of, kind of like it better down here. Uh, decisions, maybe right here. Hmm. Like there's not really any really good spots. I want it to be somewhere that I can just grab it easily. It really doesn't look good there. How about, let's just put it there. That's a good spot. Yay. And let's just take a bunch of stuff out of here. Uh, watering can, scythe, and then the rest can stay there. The stuff that goes there will be the stuff that I grab before I take off for the day. It's 9 p.m. I think it's time to wrap this up. Oh, like I feel like I still have a lot more to say, but like, you know, time is time and time keeps going forward no matter what you do. So, yeah, like I, I guess uh, if you have any suggestions for how to go about trauma therapy, feel free to leave a comment. Like, I probably, like, I definitely won't see it uh, before I have to go, because I'm going in half an hour. But uh, if you've got any ideas, um, like, please share them. Like, coping mechanisms? Awesome! Um, oh, here's a coping me mechanism I have. I have, uh, thanks to DBT therapy, group therapy, um, a, what I call a happy box, which is actually a wine bottle holder that I have just filled with junk that makes me happy. So, yeah, I've got that. I'm taking that with me. Uh, and, oh, I forgot. I have a cup of tea. So that makes me happy. All right. Well, good night, everybody. I need to go get ready. So I hope that you have a wonderful day. If you're struggling with your own stuff, then like I totally believe in you. And that especially goes out to Leafy Greens. If you happen to be watching Leafy Greens, I've recently discovered your channel and you are so brave and I really admire you. So, okay. All right. That's enough. I need, I need to, I need to go. Good night.
Yeah, not a whole lot of profit, but still good.